Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'm gonna to show you how to use properly your uh, Kuki G35 utility plate if you're uh, using a camera that is uh, not a GoPro. If you have an Insta360 or if you're mounting a different GoPro mount uh, or um, a different GoPro camera like a uh, Max or any other camera uh, with the roller mount and the utility plate. So uh, let's flip the camera, go check it out real quick. All right, so if you're mounting your GoPro on the utility plate on the Kuki G35, you will need uh, obviously the roller mount to be able to attach the GoPro to the mount that comes with the utility plate or the base that comes with the utility plate. But if you're also mounting a different type of camera, a non-GoPro camera like a Insta360 or the Hero Max camera that has, has a different um, um, base, uh, there are also some alternatives that you can use with the roller mount. And uh, we've had a lot of questions about this, so I'm gonna show you exactly what parts you need when you get everything in, what you need to take apart, which basically the roller mount, you just take, have to take apart the roller mount and use some parts from the roller mount on the utility plate. So let's flip the camera and get to it right. Hey, before we start, please hit that like button. It really helps our channel grow. Thank you. Okay, so here we have Cookie utility plate. We have a roller mount. I'm using a one for a Hero 2 camera because I um, just want to show you what parts you need. And we have another mount that can you be used with the roller mount for the Insta360 camera. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is take the hardware, the, your Allen key, and take those two little Allen screws that go all the way through. Take those apart and just take the camera mount, the, the mount apart. These still, those screws come apart like that and just pull that out. That way you can disassemble this part. This part becomes that. So you substitute this for, uh, this for that with the roller mount. If you're using a roller mount on a different helmet, like, uh, um, I mean, you can use these, the, these parts on any roller mount. Uh, in this case, we're doing it with the G35. So just take that screw out of there because you will need those two little side uh, parts here, which basically attach to this, okay? So this is where you attach them. I'm gonna take this off of the plate. This doesn't come out that easily. It's just because it hasn't been installed on the helmet. And then just put your Insta360 or other type of camera mount in there. Hold it in place like so. See how that works just sort of like the roller mount. And I recommend uh, putting it upside down so you can see the screws go into the, um, the part here that uh, holds the screw in place like so the way you're, you're making sure it's going in straight and you're not gonna um ruin the threads on the uh on the uh, actual part here one thing to keep in mind these screws are stainless steel but that part the nut where it screws into is aluminium so don't over tighten them you can put some uh, thread lock there that way you don't uh, uh, risk uh, stripping those uh, nuts in there. And that's how you mount it. That's all you need. And just install that on your utility plate and you're good to go. I have another video and I'll leave a link uh, where you can find a link to the video on how to install the utility plate on your Kuki G35. I'm just installing this like that so you can have an idea what parts you need uh, to install that on the utility plate. But this should be already in your uh, helmet. And once you put that on your top plate there, it holds in place with the uh, cutaway strap that holds it in place uh, permanently. So that's how you install a different camera setup on your utility plate with the roller mount. So when you are uh, on our website and you are in the G35 category, let's say you already ordered your helmet, you go into the related products and you can see the top plates 
that are available here. When you go to select the, the option, the last one will be the utility plate. You select that. Remember, utility plate comes with everything you see here, the two straps, the roller mount base and the blank base. Then you select that, you add it to your cart. Then you want to select the roller mount which is camera specific remember that if you're using it for um the, depending on the gopro you're going to be using you can select here in the menu let's say you're using a hero 9 or a 10 or 11 select that that'll work for either of those cameras but if you're using a different one uh you definitely need to get the whole base because you will need some parts from this uh and if you're looking to use another camera let's say an insta360 just get that base here the low pro mofo cookie roller mount camera housing and basically this is just the top part the top part that houses the camera all the rest you take from the roller mount like these two parts here and the screws and that's all you need just add it to your cart check out and you're good to go if you like this video please hit the like button subscribe and hit the bell to get our latest notifications thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one